All right, I kind of got it tuned a little bit. Actually, I ran out of gas. It wasn't a matter of tuning. So this is how you start. Just give this a crank over. Doesn't require, you know, a great deal of effort, but it is a heavy wheel. There it goes. Call it shock. You just bit me. I almost dropped the phone. It's so easy to start now. And that's how you stop it. You run it out of gas. If you don't run it out of gas and you like short the, the points, there's a little uh, electrical connection on the outside that you can ground out. That'll uh, short the ignition. That'll stop it, but uh, it'll also foul the plugs. And you'll have a heck of a time getting it started. But uh, it's running. Although my float is... Uh, isn't working right. It's actually uh, uh, flooding the, the whole carburetor if I let it sit with the fuel going into it. So I'm going to have to drop the bowl and find out why, what's wrong with that needle since it's brand new as you can see. Let's see, it's Denny's Carb Shop Tractor Products. And they did this and this is the first time it's run um, with this carburetor on it. So it should work. And I'm curious about the metric bolt. That just uh, seems kind of dumb to me. There's actually a metric bolt on there.